Bradley. What? He killed Uncle Marcus. Abby! Bradley poisoned him. Whoa, what? No, I didn't. Yes, you did. It must no, have been No, no, no. My poisons went missing. Okay, I would never use them. But I know how dangerous they are and, and just you owning them is... Stop lying, okay? You got what you wanted. I didn't kill him! Fuck. Fuck. If someone else used my poisons... Oh, I, 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 I can't go to jail. I, I won't survive inside. I'd rather die. Oh, shit. Bradley, no! Shit. Oh, I can't look! This is really oh. scaring me hey, now. what's going on there, guys? Signal's really bad here. Bradley, listen to me, OK? What's done is done, OK? You don't have to lose your life, too. I didn't do it. Why would I do it? I, I don't even have a motive. You were obsessed with murders and, and serial killers. What? That's not a motive. That's a hobby. I love... Fantasy novels too, it doesn't make me a fucking elf. But the poison. Yeah, I told you I, I didn't use them. Someone else took them. I would never use them. Oh shit. Oh shit, Bradley. Bradley, listen. Just put the gun down, okay? Put it down. It wasn't me. I know. I know. I believe you. I know. Really? Yeah. Okay. Bradley! <laughs> Mum! No! Jesus Christ, Abby, what have you done? <gasps> Sorry, guys, you cut out there. What'd I miss? Where's Mum? Toby. Sorry, Ab. You're talking to me? You killed Uncle Marcus. I grilled a cow carcass. What? When? Abs? No, you know my thoughts on barbecues. I mean, all that smoke. You killed Uncle Marcus. What? Flick, sort your daughter out! Abby! No, it's true. Toby poisoned him at the meeting. Just tell them the truth, Toby. No, I didn't. Toby, I know you're lying. So uh, just tell them the truth. All right, all right. You want the truth? Fine, fine. I'm fucked. I'm absolutely... Fucked, and I'm even more fucked now if the only person who could help me is dead. What? How could I poison Uncle Marcus at the meeting when I couldn't even get near to him? I needed his help. I've lost every penny of this school's fund in a fucking hole in the ground. What are you talking about? I put the money into a diamond mine. I was told I would make millions for the charity, obviously, but then Amnesty fucking International exposed the mine as using slave labour, which I knew nothing about, by the way. I lost every penny. But with Uncle Marcus dead, his share <sighs> of the company will go to the family. But I don't have time for that. I can't wait a couple of months for a will to be sorted out. The auditor's deadline was yesterday. I needed the money. Yesterday, Marcus was my last chance. Wait, so you didn't do it? No! I don't know what the fuck you're talking about and the only reason I did this stupid fucking quiz is to say goodbye because I meant to have an accident and disappear yeah oh shit I mean you know I, I mean I could have you know, an accident because you know the because of the, the jungle roads the and the the you're listening to relax oh. sounds of Africa oh. Oh. Three. fucking hell Toby Tommy! Wait, I know that place. That's not Africa. That's Muswell Hill. He never even left London, that lying little bastard. Abigail, what have you done? <laughs> Auntie June. Unless you're going to tell me, I can carry on with my round. I don't want to know. What am I doing in here? I know it was you. You killed Uncle Marcus. You poisoned him at the meeting. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, well, that's been coming, I must say. Was that the guilt? What? Did the guilt make you do that? <laughs> <laughs>
No, it was the wine. What have I got to feel guilty about? I just told you before you threw up. You, you killed Uncle Marcus. You poisoned him at the meeting, and I'm not going to let you get away with it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Marcus is dead. <laughs> well. Well, I can't say I'm going to miss him. <laughs> you killed him. Oh, fucking hell, Abigail. What do you think I am? I mean, look at me. I'm a mess. I can barely keep track of what day it is, let alone plan an intricate poisoning. Christ, especially at the meeting. God, I was off my face. Look, I'm not surprised someone's had a go at the old prick, but it wasn't me. I'm sorry. I know you'd love to ruin me like this. What? Oh, you hate me. I terrify you. I, I'm, I'm the product of what this family can do to you, how it can destroy you. But you know what? It's exactly why I hate you. You've still got a chance. You're young, you're smart. You can still get out now before it destroys you. But you won't, will you? Because you're just like me. I don't know what to say. <sighs> Auntie June? Are you asleep? Oh my God. This is the worst night of my life. <laughs> Nan, we need to talk. What is it, love? What's wrong? Uncle Marcus is dead. What, what, what do you mean, love? Has there been some sort of accident? He's dead, Nan. You killed him. I, I'm lost. <gasps> is this part of the quiz? It was you, Nan. I know it was you. I know you killed him. Prove it. You can't, can you? I'll, I'll find... I'll... Oh, Abby. What a stupid girl you've been. You know what this means, don't you? Now that Marcus is dead, his share of the business comes back to me. I own all of it. You'd be amazed what you can make disappear if you wave a big enough number in someone's face. It was you. Please, Abby. If you value everything you have, everything this family's given you, let it go. Mum? Yes? You tried to kill Uncle Marcus. What are you talking about? I'm talking about you poisoning Uncle Marcus. I know it was you. Oh, Abby. I always hoped this wouldn't happen to you. Your father was like this towards the end. Seeing things, imagining things. I always hoped he hadn't passed it on to you, although the, the medication was making it worse, but... You're just like him. No, this is real. And you tried to kill Uncle Marcus. Why?
Why would I kill the man? For the money? For the business? Risking everything I have? My entire business and career that I've built up over 30 years for some garden centres and a few spas? Do you really think that little of me, Abby? I... You really don't know me at all, do you? You really didn't do it. Heaven knows why you've concocted this strange little fantasy. Look, I'm sorry, Abby, but whatever's going on here, I can't be part of it. What? I promised myself when your father became unwell that if anything like that ever happened to you, I couldn't put myself through that again. And I'm not going to break that promise. It's time I started putting myself first. <laughs> I hope you can find the help you need, Abby. Oh, and if you ever do get better, feel free to give me a call. You're probably better to text first, though. <laughs> what the hell? Lottie? What, babe? I know what you did at the meeting. I just, I don't know why. I don't know what you're talking about, babe. Look, it's over, Lottie. Just tell the truth. I am. Lottie, what's going on? It was only a bit of coke. Excuse me? What? Just for some extra cash on the side. And my supplier's like really legit. So I'm only ever selling the pure stuff. So I'm basically doing my friends a service. I wasn't even supposed to be at the meeting. There was a super huge party going on and everyone was looking to me for the, you know. The drugs. Yeah, exactly right. I couldn't just let them down. So a friend came over and collected the stuff. I only came to the meeting because I wanted to see Uncle Marcus to give him my audition tape. Sent him like a million links and he's never replied, so I assume the guy must be pretty analog. I'd be great for one of his movies, wouldn't I? But you, you poisoned him. Lottie, have you been selling your sister LSD? No, I only do coke, all natural. Uncle Marcus was poisoned at the meeting and it has to be you. Babe, why would I want to kill the guy who's gonna put me in his movie? It doesn't make any sense. Shit. Shit. It wasn't you. Yeah. Oh, shit. Uh, the quiz is over, right, guys? Lottie, what's going on? Um, I've got to go. Who's at your door? Right, it's not a fucking on. Um, it, it, friends. Friends? Uh, Who's yeah, we play guy? this game where they, uh, try to my door down and I hide. Lottie! We're done here, right? Awesome quiz, guys. Happy birthday, Mum. Gotta go. Bye! Abby, you better start explaining all this right now. I really don't think I can.